Welcome to today's tutorial on training YOLO V8 classification models on your custom dataset. In this video, we will cover all the necessary steps to successfully train and validate a YOLO V8 model for classification. Let's get started. Before we begin, let's make sure we have access to a GPU for faster training. We can check this by running the command NVIDIA SMI. If you don't have access to a GPU, don't worry. You can navigate to Runtime, change Runtime Type, set it to GPU, and then click Save. Let's run the command now. Excellent! Now that we have our GPU set up, let's move on to installing YOLO V8. There are two ways to do this, from the source for development or via PIP. PIP method is the recommended method. We'll go with the PIP install method for simplicity. After installing YOLO V8, we need to import the necessary libraries. Let's import the required libraries. Ultralytics is the core library we'll be using. Now that we have YOLO V8 installed and ready to go, let's move on to preparing our custom dataset. To train a YOLO V8 classification model on your custom dataset, you need to ensure that your dataset is structured correctly. Each dataset should have separate folders for train, test, and validation data, with subfolders for each class containing the corresponding images. Here's an example of the required dataset structure. For this tutorial, we'll use a pre existing characters dataset for demonstration purposes. You can download this dataset by running the command below. If you're following along with your own dataset, make sure to place your zip data file in the home directory of the notebook. You can easily upload data to the home directory as you can see. Now let's unzip the dataset. Make sure your dataset follows this structure before proceeding further. Great! We now have our custom dataset ready for training. Let's move on to the next step, custom training. Let's run the command below to train YOLO V8 model on the custom dataset. Here we have multiple options for models to fine-tune like YOLO V8 Nano, YOLO V8 Small, YOLO V8 Medium, YOLO V8 Large, YOLO V8 Extra Large model. For this tutorial, I will select YOLO V8 Medium model to fine-tune. This process might take some time, depending on the complexity of the dataset and the number of epochs we set. Let's get back when once the training is complete. Great! The model is trained. After training the custom model, it's essential to validate its performance. To validate the model, run the command. This command will evaluate the model's performance on the validation dataset and provide valuable insights into its accuracy. Results are saved in the directory. Let's run these commands. These commands will provide us with valuable insights into how well our model is classifying objects. Now comes the exciting part. We will perform inference using our custom model on some test images. This will demonstrate how accurately our model can classify in real-world scenarios. Let's take a look at a few examples. Amazing! Our custom YOLO V8 classification model has successfully classifying the test images. This showcases the power and accuracy of YOLO V8 when trained on a custom dataset. If you want to export your YOLO V8 model to a different format, such as ONNX or OpenVINO, you can use the export functionality. Supported formats are listed here. Choose the format you prefer and run the corresponding export command to export your model. As here I want to export my model in one format, run the command. Finally, if you want to download your trained model, you can use the following command. 
this command will download the model file to your local machine. Congratulations! You have successfully learned how to train Yolov 8 classification models on your custom dataset. Feel free to experiment with different datasets and parameters to achieve optimal results. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more tutorials.